So let's get started. If you come to the Florida State University Libraries homepage, click on Databases A to Z, we're going to talk about three major products, Mergent Online, the Edgar Search, and then Privco. Uh, Edgar uh, is, of course, the SEC's website. That's sec.gov. But uh, the other two, Mergent and Privco, are only available through the library's homepage. So you have to make sure you log in. One of the, ni the neat things about uh, Mergent Online is it has a company financial section that goes back uh, to all reported, all available years which for the most part goes back to the 1994. Uh, it does go back further than that, but uh, generally uh, the full data is only back to 1994. Uh, and it, you'll notice here it, it covers the as reported, preliminary data, standardized data, and restated data. This is the full cycle of data that's reported on company financials for public companies. It also covers uh, additionally ratios and some analysis of the financials. So those can be really great tools for you as you uh, take a class in um, finance or accounting. Another tool that you might find useful is something called Privco. Um, and if we go ahead and look at, say, Barnes & Noble, you'll notice that it gives you uh, five years worth of data on uh, company finances for Barnes & Noble. One of the things you have to realize is that private companies don't aren't required to give any financial data to anyone. But uh, there's a, a number of different places that uh, Privco goes to get this information, including such things as lawsuits. If they're trying to raise cash, they sometimes put out a prospectus those kinds of things. So uh, Privco can be a really great tool for private company information, generally above $100 million. The final tool that you might find useful is Edgar. And um, if you go into Edgar, um, there's a fast search tool uh, where you can either company do a company name search or type in by fast search Apple and use their uh, ticker symbol AAPL. Um, and then from there you can pull up uh, just the 10Ks for Apple. And it includes all of the 10Ks back to, uh, again, 1994, uh, which is when the SEC started making them public. Prior to that time, it gets a little difficult. Come talk to me at or send me an email at twyckoff, W-Y-C-K-O-F-F, -F, at fsu.edu. Talk to you soon.